Hey y'all, what's up? Bill here. Well, yesterday I went pop hunting and, well, when you go out, okay, how many stores do you normally hit? Because me and my daughter have been watching videos of other people going hunting and they hit like, what, two or three stores? Depends on what they're exactly looking for. Man, I wish I could only hit like two or three stores, but I normally hit every store that I, you know, get to you know so basically we went when we went yesterday we had um let's see three walmarts two targets um four game stops yeah and uh, three stores at the mall which are um fye uh hot topics and um what was this other one Another GameStop in there. Oh, let's see. Crap. FYE. Hot Topics. And Lunchbox. That's what it was. Yeah. So we hit all those and didn't find nothing at the mall. But most of the um, Walmarts didn't have anything in there. Um, the two targets where I went looking for a Thanos 10 inch figure where I knew it wasn't going to be in there, but I figured I'd take a chance. So. Whatever. So, I, so this is the first thing I got. I think with a GameStop was the Shark Bowl. I just really like it. I got Jaws. They call it Shark Attack. I think it's just cool looking. I don't think I'll ever use it, but I just like it. You know, it's just it's kind of I don't know. I don't think I'll ever use it, but I just, <laughs> I just like it. Shark ball. See? Can't even see it. <laughs> I was kind of, I'm not sure how you can eat with the teeth right there and there's a, a lip on both sides. So, it's kind of cool. I had to put it in my collection. I think it went on sale. The second thing I picked up was Jason's body knocker. <laughs> I don't think it's going to work. It's not charged or whatever. But yeah, we won that for a while. And the next thing I couldn't believe was in Walmart. I think it was Walmart. Yeah, it was Walmart. And I think it's new too. I saw it there and was like, oh, this is the four all together. Can't believe they actually have him the way he's supposed to look, you know? They had a, all three. I don't think they had Batman there, but they had they had a Aquaman and a Green Lantern. So I picked up this one. I think it's kind of cool. So, yeah, I had to pick it up. I think it's the only real Green Lantern figure I have besides the plastic one. Big plastic one. So, my daughter only had like I think two pops and she watches the show. I think it's called My Hero Academy, Academy or something like that. And she wanted this figure. And she said if I didn't pick it up I would probably regret it. So, I got this from Collector Zone. Marcos found it and let me know. I was like, hey, I heard you were looking for this. Remember? So, I got these and I was like, yeah, cool. She'll be happy. Aren't you happy? <laughs> so, yeah, it, it does look kind of cool you know I like the hair and I like the goggles and the whole scarf thing it's different you know she really oh see it you gotta be careful this thing is not stand up too well so yeah I like the the goggles on it it was kind of cool that figure yeah so I got her one got me one it's different you know so, if she's all happy, I'm all happy, so. Alright, so, when I go pop hunting, 
and I can't find characters that are from my childhood, I guess you could say, and growing up, or if I can't find a movie character I like or something, I go for the, my third option. And I, I wouldn't say I'm obsessed with this part of the pops, you know. I wouldn't say that if I pick one up and it, it qualifies in in this area, then it's like, I gotta have it. I may not know what the character is, but I'll find out what the character is. But you know what? It's just... Okay. It's basically... This is the guy that started it for me, okay? The master from the strain. If you do not have this pop, something is seriously wrong with you. Okay? Because this got me started on heavy pops. I'm not talking about 10 inch pops or 6 inch pops. I'm talking about normal size pops that are heavy. Okay? And believe me, this one has some weight on it, which is really what I liked about it. It's like, he's just in his robe. It's kind of bland, you know. But, yeah, I knew this was not going to work. But, oh well, it works a little bit for me, so I'm happy. So, it's just, I like the way he looks. and looks really cool, you know? I just like the way he looks. So, this guy got me started on Heavy Pops. All right. And I went up looking for just Heavy Pops. And I found some other ones between the last year. He is... He's, I would say he is, there's some weight to him, but I would not say he's as heavy as this one, maybe. I was trying to find my scale, but I could not find it, because I wanted to weigh him and see how much they actually weigh, you know? So he has a little weight to him, but not extraordinary heavy, I would say. And then this guy came by. And he's, there's some weight to him too, but he's not, I would say he's still heavy, okay? I would definitely say there's a lot of weight, probably because of the robe and stuff, but yeah, there is definitely some weight to the master, but he's still, <laughs> there's definitely weight to these, okay? I, I can't really say they're light, all right? Now, how to do this? I'll put them back all back on in a minute. But, give me a second. Uh, okay, I shall put these up. These two are a throw up, but, okay. Then, yesterday, I found this one. And there is some weight to him because of that drum. Okay? That drum on his back put some weight onto it. Okay? And he just looked cool. It's like, it fit my category of it, of the weight being there. So, that made me happy. And the character didn't really look that bad at all. You know? The look on his face and what he's wearing and stuff. So yeah, there's definitely some weight there. Now it doesn't really matter to me if I know the show or not. Just if I like the way the character looks and if I'm looking and going, if I say yeah, I want this, I'm gonna get it. But there's definitely, I think it's only because of the top part in there and the look at his face. I just like the way he looked, you know. I just and look at his feet. <laughs> so, yeah, that's just definitely. So I figure I'm going like, oh yeah, this, this one's gonna be the heaviest one I find. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Okay, between these two, I can't tell which one's heavier. 
I really, I, I can't even go by which one, which one to show you first because I can't say, well, this one looks cooler than this one because these ones, these are about even. So I will show this guy first because the other one, look at this dude. And if you think there is no weight to this, then you're just absolutely crazy, okay? And I love the way it looks. I like the whole blue scene through and stuff and everything. But this guy, there is some freaking weight on this. Because I always thought that the master was heavy. But now, uh -uh. this one, and two other ones I have, way more than the master, master wear, weighs. But it just looks so cool. You know? I love the... A little stitch in the forehead too, but let's see if I can get a little closer without getting blurry. I don't know, but yeah, there's a lot of detail. And if you want to see a top, let's see if I can get the top going. Him and that weapon of his, it comes down. Like a fire lash or something. Do I recommend to pick it up just because of the weight? No, because it looks like a cool figure. But yeah, because it's heavier than hell, I would definitely pick it up. And there's a lot of detail on it. There's a whole bunch of detail in this thing, you know? So I would definitely recommend you picking it up. I wish your tail was a little longer, but I definitely, definitely can recommend you picking this up. Oh, this this one I am so happy I found because oh, when you see it, you know why. Well, this guy has some weight on him, okay. And the detail. There's parts of it that, uh, but still, I really, really. <laughs> Between this one and the other one, I, I couldn't figure out which, which weighed more. You know, I couldn't. I couldn't. I mean, you probably could if you guys picked it up, but he just looks. Really cool though. I love how bloody he looks and everything too. The back, I don't know. So when I look at this part right here, um, I don't know. Looks like the paint job could have been done a little better. But yeah, I didn't even see the back till now. But. This is absolutely a crazy pop, you know. I can definitely recommend you picking up these two. Okay. If you see them, wherever you see them, if you want to find a place to order them, I would definitely get these in your collection. I'm just glad it's heavy and I like it because there are some... You cannot put these pops, I don't think, on top of another pop. You have to put these on the bottom if you stack them. I stack mine too high as far as I go. I never put the heavy ones on top. This is definitely a, a base pop. They never never put this on top of another one. I'm glad he's not wearing shoes, though. I don't think it would look right if he was wearing shoes. And I love that look on his face. I wish it was more to his face a little bit, but no. Nah. I just really like the way he looks. You know? Sometimes you just have to admire the artwork on me sometimes, you know? I'm really surprised he put so much blood on his, on his shirt and everything. But yeah. 
edge groovy. Now this top, oh, I thought it would be heavier. And, ooh, yeah, I believe this is the heaviest one out of all of them. And oh man, it's just when I saw it, I was like, oh man. And I picked it up. I was like, whoa. <laughs> No, I, yeah, I, I'm thinking this is the heaviest top there is. And, okay, if you see this one, you definitely got to pick it up. When I saw this one, I was like, oh yeah, I don't care if it's light or what, I am picking this up. I just like how he sits in this chair. There is not really a lot. Of uh, heavy pops out there. He's probably not even all of them. If you guys know of any other heavy pops, let me know. Okay, where I can find them, what they're called, and if I like them, I'll I'll pick them up. There's no way that I would give these pops up at all. I know these are heavier than the Master, but the Master I would never give up. Okay, the Master I would never. I just like the way it looks. And I'm surprised he didn't have a chase, though, you know? I mean, because he did get messed up in the, in the show. And I'm surprised he didn't, like, have a chase of his, his cloak messed up or him burnt up a lot more. But still kind of looking the same, so as we always do, because we all know that Bunko's lazy or broke, one or two. I don't know what she does. So, yeah. There's not much around except in his chair. I like that chair, and I like his cloak, and I like how it comes up, up to his head and his shoulder pads. <laughs> It's just a cool looking pop. I'm glad I found it. Also, um, Barnes and Nobles, we went there, so four stores in the mall. But Barnes and Nobles didn't have anything. Which really surprised me, because I know we find at least one that I want. And, uh, Hot Topics didn't have anything at all. And, um, Lunchbox didn't have anything at all either. That's what really surprised me. Normally, I see at least one or two of them that I like. But no. So, what do you guys think of these pops? Are these pops that you, you, you picked up or you want to pick up? Because or... I can definitely recommend... These four pops. If there's a way I can fit them all on here at one time. Maybe not. I don't know. I can definitely recommend. If you like the weight. If you like heavy pops. I can recommend you picking up these four pops. I can definitely recommend you picking up the master. Because he is a master of all my pops. He's a master. See. He's. 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 They don't do nothing without his permission at all. In the slightest. Yeah. Okay. I'm a little off. I know that. But yeah. It's just. I don't know. I'm just glad I found these. Because they're really good pops, though. There's nothing. I couldn't find anything wrong with them. All the paint job is really good on it. The stance is really good on them. I really couldn't find anything wrong. You know? This guy <laughs> has to be probably, I don't know, after the Masters, probably one of my favorite ones. But this dude, Oh man, 
He can tear it up. Look at that weapon. This guy here, or is it this one? When you find this guy, look at how he is in the box, okay? Because normally you have, he's in an insert, right? He has two inserts, one on top and one on the bottom, I believe. He does not even have a full insert because he barely fits in the box. He doesn't fit in the box at all. It kind of, it kind of pokes to the front. So if you think the box is damaged, it's not. It's just he does not go in the box too well. So, yeah. But I'm really happy I found all these. But I think that is it. So thank you for watching and hope you enjoyed it. And you all take care and have fun pop hunting. And definitely find these four pops. Okay? Let's do that one. And, well, okay. Especially that one. No, way. Especially, just go out and find them all, okay? Just, all right. I shall check you guys later. Bye.